Greg Walker saw nothing but great moments ahead of him in becoming a Bobcat. came down to a no-brainer that if I want to do well and prosper and from a basketball perspective, and while I was going to school, then Brandon would be the, the ultimate choice. Walker went to the same high school in Ontario as Ewan Roberts and played against Sean Gray growing up. You know, it was a family atmosphere and a relationship, so to speak. So uh, that was in the water. The fact that it was like family uh, going there. The Bobcat dynasty of the 1980s was another drawing card for Walker. He got the chance to add to that legacy in 1996 as Brandon captured the program's fourth national title. Walker redshirted and relished the role. We are always part of the scout team, right? So from a practicing perspective, we would go at it and go at it hard every single practice against the, the guys to help prepare them, but it also was helping prepare us as well. BU is back in the running for the top prize in 1999-2000, and Walker was a big reason why. He was named a Great Plains Athletic Conference All-Star and a National Tournament All-Star. The U Sports Final came down to the wire, with the Cats losing a one-point game to St. FX. What could have been, uh, it, it's, it's there, but I have good memories, good friends out of it. I have a lot of pictures and I have video and experiences that I, I was able to uh, obtain during that time is, is invaluable. As he transitioned to life after the Bobcats, Walker remained in the spotlight. He got involved in making movies and his basketball knowledge came in handy. I was a special skills extra film coordinator basketball wise so, you know, basketball helped me be able to, you know, land those type of jobs where I was basically coaching uh, actors on set, you know, and behind the scenes and a couple of times I was in front of the camera. Walker spent close to a decade in the film industry. The Dennis Rodman story stands out. It was fun to coach the Dennis Rodman lookalike or who was playing Dennis Rodman to try to play like Dennis Rodman and guess what? Uh, he wasn't the best basketball player, so to try to make him look as good as Dennis Rodman did in the early days was fun. Walker went from lights, camera, action to the business world with computer sales and tech support. Since 2009, he's been living in Texas with his wife and three kids. I actually wanted to coach for a living, to be honest with you. That was my first thought that I would do after when basketball was all said and done but uh, it didn't work out that way. It was just different in Canada in terms of wanting to coast for a living and where you have to start. And uh, I was impatient. I didn't want to start there, you know. I'm going to chase other things. Walker's journey has taken him on many different life trails. The path of Bobcat basketball is one he was proud to walk on. I tell a lot of people that a lot of the things I'm able to enjoy from a success perspective came from basketball and obviously a large part of that is in Brandon.